My presentation is titled Empowering Catalonia, Promoting Healthcare Equity Through Upscaling of Digital Solutions. So let's just start. So digital health solutions. Their availability and popularity has risen substantially in the last 10 years, and they have become important tools for health for healthcare, both for the management of personal health and for the support to the clinical practice, as they allow for a redefinition of uh, the relationship between patients and professionals in terms of efficiency and effectiveness. So what about digital, he digital health solutions in Catalonia? Before diving into the matter, I want to introduce two subgroups in which we separate the solutions, patient-centered solutions and health and wellness solutions. Patient-centered solutions um, are solutions that allow a digital relationship between patients and healthcare centers in, um, or systems um, and allow users to consult information on their personal health record. And, and then health and wellness solutions are solutions for healthcare and promotion and are usually centered on specific medical specialties. So regarding patient center solutions, La Meva Salut, or My Own Health in English, is the main personal health record for all citizens of Catalonia. And, um, well, yeah, it is the main personal health record for all citizens in Catalonia. And in addition, um, many hospitals in Catalonia have developed um, individual solu uh, digital solutions which provide specific added functionalities. And also, this methodology has some advantages Many challenges current, uh, currently persist with this methodology, and that is um, the need for different sign-ons for La Meva Salud and for the hospital solutions, and um, the fact that in rural areas, many hospitals have um, less functionalities in their digital solutions or they directly don't have them, and this uh, increases, um, uh, uh, decreases healthcare equity and this is aggravated by, by the fact that rural areas have um, less access to digital resources. And then, uh, talking about health and wellness solutions, nowadays there exist hundreds of thousands of solutions available, and th this makes it difficult for both for patients and health professionals to choose the optimal solutions as they have no reference to choose them. And on the other hand, the quality of those solutions is usually not assessed, and this is especially damaging for patients directly using um, their solutions independently. So, um, uh, for all these reasons, in Tic Salud Social, along with Cat Salud, which is the public insurance, uh, which, which is the public insurance, and within the Ministry of Health of Catalonia, we have initiated a project to identify, adopt, and upscale digital health solutions within the Catalan healthcare system with La Meva Salud. And to start, with, to start with, we have developed an observatory for digital health solutions developed by Catalan hospitals in order to identify the solutions and also analyze the services or functionalities that, that they offer. So, uh, moving on to cur the current perspectives and centering on the part of the observatory centered to patient center solutions, um, concerning the solutions developed by <laughs> Catalan hospitals, 61% of the hospitals of, offer digital services, which means that, um, well, 61% have uh, digital solutions that provide uh, added functionalities other than uh, general information about the center. And from this 61%, we have observed that 80% of those offer their services through an app and about 50% offer their services through a website. Through, sorry, 80% through the web and about 50% through an app. Then in this slide, you can observe a map of the location of the hospitals in the region with digital services and you can observe that, uh, well, a lack, of, uh, regional, uh, a lack of regional equity as most of the solutions are centered around Barcelona, the main city. And then um, what we also have observed is that the services offered in the solutions can be grouped into different categories, which are the following. Appointment scheduling management, so, such as cancellation or rescheduling of appointments, preparation for hospital visits, including patient education, and waiting times inside a hospital, 
then hospital experience enhancement, enhancement during appointments, for example, registry of entry, and during admissions, for example, information about programmed medical tests, support for patient companions, such as information on surgery progression and telecommunication. Now, we have selected some of the services offered, which lay into one of the previous categories, and we have ordered them um, in order of like the percentage of um, offering in those hospitals. Um, so like in order, cancellation of appointments, information about surgery progression, progression um, ER waiting times, registration of entry, integrated vid video consultations, and something very interesting that is a directory of prescribed uh, health and wellness solutions. We have also analyzed the services offered in the private sector, and we have observed that uh, in general, the public sector offers um, more uh, services related to informing the patient and their companions, and the private sector offers more services related to scheduling and telecommunication. Overall, you can observe that the percentages vary, vary quite considerably. Now, moving on to the part of the Observatory Health Center to Health and Wellness Solutions, um, and the solutions developed by Catalan hospitals, the solutions um, center on a quite wide range of medical specialties, with most of them centered around public health and prevention, neurology, mental health, and cardiology. Now, finally, we want to show an example of an app developed by a high technology hospital in Catalonia, which is very useful, which uh, provides uh, the, telemonitor the telemonitoring of patients for a great number of pathologies, processes, and medical specialties, and has a specific methodology developed for each the, by delivering health assessment forms, challenges, and exercises, among many others, to the patients. And yeah, it is integrated with the hospital information system. And as it is, as it is giving very positive results, it is, the willingness is to scale it around many other hospitals in Catalonia. So um, now we have a general overview of digital health solutions in Catalonia, but which initiatives are we currently applying in order to upscale them? Um, first of all, through shared decision making within the Ministry of Health of Catalonia, we are establishing the basis for the inclusion of digital health solutions in La Meva Salut, in order, that, in order that all Catalan citizens have all relevant solutions in a single digital space. Um, the idea is to do this by applying a single sign-on uh, that is um, um, signing in in all solutions with the credentials of La Meva Salut and to, redirect, and to redirect to those solutions when clicking them from um, a section in La Meva Salut. Uh, for, mm, for this reason, we are developing a methodological, a methodological guide for, develop, for the developers of all types of solutions, um, which is based on recently published technical specifications, and it will be made available to all hospitals within the Catalan healthcare system in order that they can adapt and upscale their, their solutions. Regarding initiatives on patient-centered solution, uh, we are doing further analysis um, in two ways, by, doing, by evaluating the current use of La Mea Salud and more specifically on some, of the, um, on some of its functionalities and by doing interviews uh, to the hospitals within the Catalan healthcare system in order to uh, obtain more information about their developed digital health solutions. Regarding initiatives on health and wellness solutions, we have been um, promoting their, their use for years now and also their quality. As in 2016, we um, presented our app certi certification service in order to promote their quality around, uh, well, around Catalonia. And in 2022, a public competition was published which um, obligated for certification uh, in order to be able to compete and therefore we were able to certify nine additional apps. Um, in 2022 as well, we started collaborating in la Label to Enable project, uh, which wants to promote um, trustworthy European certification and quality label for health apps that you can observe on the screen. 
And finally, in the same year, we also started the publication of a, a health and wellness uh, digital assets directory in our website, which allows Catalan citizens to have a reference for useful digital health solutions. Now, um, we, here we show a roadmap of our future steps. And as you can see, by the end of 2023, we will have the first, first draft of the methodological guide that I explained. Um, and we will also have the social apps published in our directory. By the first quarter of 2024, we will have the final version of the methodological guide, and we will also present a report on the results of the observatory. Mid-2024, we will do a selection of apps to pilot their inclusion in La Meva Salud. And we will also present a new, more attractive and user-friendly directory with all uh, patient-centered solutions that we, have, um, that we have found, as well as their services. And finally, by the end of 2024, we will do an evaluation of all possible, um, well, of all um, solutions that can be scalable to La Mea Salud um, and start the process to include them in this app. And finally, a stake home message. Um, first, we want to highlight the value of digital health solutions for, health, for healthcare, both to patients and to health professionals and also the importance of doing a broad analysis on available solutions to shed light on the functionality of these solutions and their usability, and also to avoid duplicating already existing solutions. On the other hand, uh, we, will, we also think that it is very important to facilitate the use of digital health solutions to all citizens, including professionals, as otherwise they are more likely not to use them. And we think that Providing reference for, re references for their re reliability can be very useful for citizens, uh, such as a directory of solutions or the certification process. Finally, including all relevant, all relevant digital health solutions in the same space as the citizen personal health record seems like a good technique in order to promote and upscale them. And overall, all, all efforts con can contribute to improving healthcare equity and quality. And that concludes my presentation. Thank you.